Facts. Now I gotta ask you, man, um, and this is, you know, for you to speak on and, you know, your interpretation of it. Um, you know, the situation where three was uh gunned down, uh, you're sitting down at the time. Like what's going through your head as far as, you know, to see that shit escalate to that to that moment right there? Uh, do you feel people speak shit into existence or how like and from from you, how do you feel that plays out in that scenario? Like, what are your thoughts to that? It do. Shit. Your tongue locked behind 32 bars. That's your teeth. It's a pavilous thing on your body. Whatever the fuck you say, it's going to come to exist. Believe it. You know what I'm saying? Watch what you say. That's big as facts. Damn. Nah, hey, hey. 30, hey, 32 bars behind. Hey, I like that. Uh, since that situation happened, um, the way the narrative of Dallas is, they're saying there's a void that opens up. You know what I'm saying? Of course, you know, Yella is already at, you know, he's already at the status of, you know, there ain't no turning back from where he at. Right. Uh, trap right behind him. They say that situation opened up a void in Dallas to where now the, the floodgates is open as far as what's coming out next. And then you touch down. And people were like, seemed like they were waiting on the savior for the city. Um, did you feel like, did you feel that when you came back? Were they like, okay, gonna, because there was a lot of comparison, not only from, appearance but also rap style yeah. of you and three what did you feel as far as the weight of what people were saying all right measy he's back he home the shit's about to go to another level shit that's what i'm doing now we're gonna take this shit <laughs> to the top now nah, talk about we it mash. we're gonna take this shit to the top talk about it hey it is what it is Shout out to Real Street Stars, nigga. Moving.